Ian McKellen has made a huge career announcement following his terrifying fall in June. The much-loved actor, 85, was playing John Falstaff at the Noel Coward Theatre in London's West End when he lost his footing in a fight scene and plunged headfirst into the audience. Ian pulled put of the play shortly after the accident, in which he chipped a vertebrae and fractured his wrist. Weeks later, the star admitted he was too scared to leave the house in case someone bangs into me. However, thankfully he has no plans to retire, much to fans' relief. Speaking to BBC Breakfast, the seasoned thespian said he will take the rest of the year off, but will then be back to business. What else would I be doing if I wasn't working, he asked. I shall take the rest of the year off and then get back to work in January. Just keep at it as long as the legs and the lungs and the mind keep working. Boasting a career that spans more than 50 years, the Gandalf star revealed he does sometimes struggle with his memory, but feels that is also because he has more to remember than people who are younger than him. He added. Nevertheless, it's a nuisance when you can't remember your best friend's name or forget your telephone number. If you see me or hear I'm doing something, you know it's worth doing. Whether I do it well is a matter for judgment. Speaking about the ordeal earlier this month, the actor told Saga magazine he kept reliving the fall in his head, revealing. My chipped vertebrae and fractured wrist are not yet mended. I don't go out, because I get nervous in case someone bangs into me, and I've got agonizing pains in my shoulders to do with my whole frame having been jolted. The actor, who now wears AA neck brace and wrist support, continued. But I was wearing a fat suit for Falstaff, and that saved my ribs and other joints. So I've had a lucky escape really. He added. I've relived that fall I don't know how many times. It was horrible. Commenting on whether he now feels too old to continue acting, he said. I thought it was the end of something. It was very upsetting. The end didn't mean my death. It was my participation in the play. Insisting the fall was an accident, he told the BBC. It wasn't that I.D. got dizzy or anything like that it was a pure accident. So I count myself lucky that it's beginning to be a distant memory, but it did mean that I couldn't do the tour. So if it's a chance for me to apologize to the audiences in Bristol, Birmingham, Norwich, I'm sorry I wasn't there, but I'll be back. Follow Mira Celebs on TikTok, Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and Threads.